Well, good evening and welcome to Tucker Carlson tonight. An outrage bomb went off in official Washington last night. And by dawn today, there was still a thick cloud of sanctimony and self-righteousness hanging over the city, choking out all normal life. The cause? Donald Trump Jr.'s meeting with a Russian lawyer last summer. Nobody here had ever seen anything like that before, or so they said. There was stiff competition, but Senator Richard Blumenthal of Connecticut may have won the day's Pious Indignation Award when he suggested that not only is Donald Trump Jr. a bad person, obviously, he may in fact be a Russian spy. These emails are a textbook example and evidence of criminal intent, and that is potentially a violation of the Espionage Act. Yes, treason. Yes, the Espionage Act, the very one that sent Julius and Ethel Rosenberg to the electric chair. They stole the plans to the atomic bomb. Don Trump talked to an attorney about adoption law, both massive threats to the physical and moral security of this country. CNN thought so. Its three-hour morning show spent a total of two hours and 16 minutes discussing Russia today. That left just under eight minutes for the new health care bill being debated in Congress and two minutes for sports. Pretty much nothing on anything else. 93% of airtime devoted to Russia. Keep in mind that show is shot in New York, not in St. Petersburg.